Why is Tammy Sladen's forehead attracting attention? 1,000 pound sisters fans discuss the star. Tammy Sladen's forehead recently sparked discussions and concern after followers detected something worrisome. Here are all the details about the 1,000 pound sisters star and her health. Tammy Sladen is a famous reality TV star who rose to fame after she appeared on TLC's weight loss series 1000 Pound Sisters with her sister Amy Sladen. When she joined the program, she weighed over 600 pounds. As she tried to lose weight, fans praised her, but some show viewers were worried about Tammy Sladen's forehead, which appeared to be changing in size. Tammy Sladen's forehead raises questions. During a recent 1,000 pound sisters season, viewers could not stop discussing Tammy Sladen's forehead. One viewer took to Twitter and said, I wonder if I'm the only person who judges Tammy's progress by looking at her forehead. Several other fans took to Twitter to share their concerns. One asked why people had her watching the show and wanted to know what was going on with Tammy's forehead. Another fan revealed that they did not know that her forehead was that bad, while another said her forehead fat was triggering for them. As fans raised their concerns over what was going on with Tammy's forehead, another fan wondered why doctors had never tried to fix her forehead. Unlike her sister Amy who does not have a forehead lump, the lump on Tammy's forehead is not new and has been there for years, but it attracted the attention of fans because of its size changes. According to the reality TV star's doctor, the bump is caused by her regular weight gain. When Tammy asked a doctor she had visited on the show about the lump, he told her it was a fat pocket. Tammy's doctor further stated that the lump's size would fluctuate with her weight loss and gains. Which seems to have been confirmed so far. In an early episode, Tammy's sister, Amy, said about Tammy. She just got so much fat on her body, it, came, out her forehead. Amy also said they found out at the doctor's appointment that Tammy's body ran out of places to store fat, making her body store fat in her forehead. While viewers have been concerned about Tammy's forehead, the reality TV star has suffered other health issues for quite some time and could suffer some more. Along with her forehead concerns, Viewers are also bothered that she could lose her hair as they noticed that her hairline was receding. They noted that she had almost a full head of hair earlier in the show and seemed to lose inches yearly. In one of the episodes of the recent season, Dami's brother revealed that she had a severe health scare and had to be rushed in an ambulance to the hospital. The scare had happened a day after her brother Chris had dropped her off at her weight loss rehab facility in Ohio after struggling with heaving drinking, vaping, and depression. The facility called him to inform him that Tammy had taken a turn for the worse as her lungs had stopped working, and she had quit breathing, her sister said. They're just telling us that her lungs have given up and like her body is shutting down. So at this point, you know, we're facing making funeral arrangements for my little sister. They took her to the intensive care unit, where the doctors put her on a ventilator, and she had to be placed in a medically induced coma. Her family members were scared as the doctors did not know if Tammy would make it through the next hour or even the night. After about four days, she woke up and told her family that she loved them and wanted to go home. As she started to feel better, she needed a tracheotomy to ensure emergency airway support at any time. She spent three weeks in the hospital before returning to rehab. In addition, Chris revealed that within 30 days, 
Tammy had lost over 100 pounds as she told him that she lost 115 pounds, so there might be some positive changes for Tammy. 2. My 600-pound life star Destiny Lachey dies at age 30. Her 500-pound weight loss journey inspired thousands on social media. Destiny Lachey, who was the first transgender star to appear on the TLC show My 600-pound life, has died at the age of 30. Her official cause of death has not been announced. Destiny's brother Wayne Compton, shared the news on Facebook. No 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 I'm sorry bro, I accept you for who you are, I accept every flaw that come with you, I'm sorry you felt alone, I'm sorry you felt you had nobody else to turn to, he wrote on Tuesday. I'm sorry you felt you had no other option destiny wouldn't have wanted this, Lord why keep taking my siblings away, how much can I take? Broken heart, broken heart, broken heart. The post featured photos of Wayne and Destiny and was published one day after the one year anniversary of their other sibling, Destiny's, death, per people. Destiny was open about her mental health on the show. When she first appeared on My 600 Pound Life, she weighed almost 700 pounds. I just lay here all day and wait for food. I don't see any of my family and friends, unless they come to see me, she said at the time. I feel like all I'm constantly doing is trying to escape my depression and pain at this point. Food is the only thing I can turn to to do that. I can feel it killing me. I need to be able to get help. I need to be able to lose this weight or they're going to be burying me next because I don't think I can live until next year being this big, she added. At this rate, I give myself a couple months. After her appearance on the show, Destiny lost over 500 pounds, documenting her weight loss journey on social media, per the Daily Mail. To everyone who genuinely love and support me I love you and I'm grateful to have touched millions of lives and hearts around the world, Destiny wrote on her late sibling Destiny's Facebook page. My prayer for someone struggling in any way is that you keep fighting, know you're beautiful you're strong and you can do and be anything you want and dream. Dreaming is free, love is free and most importantly God is free. Living my life with so much pain for so long I've come to realize that God makes no mistakes I'm grateful for my journey and all I've been through I don't regret a single moment. Love you all.